Hi guys, I'm Paddy from windowandoorparts.ie and in this video I'm going to show you how to fit a restrictor onto an aluminium window. So this is the restrictor we're going to use. The enhanced restrictor that's used on PVC windows generally doesn't work on aluminium and narrow frame windows because there's not enough room on the frame for the restrictor to fold up when it closes and it gets jammed. The first thing I would say before you start is to take extra care when fitting these restrictors on windows above ground floor level. Apply a cord or a strap around the drill and onto your wrist to prevent accidentally dropping the drill. This is an aluminium window that requires a restrictor. On a top hung window like this, the restrictor is fitted on the side. Generally, one restrictor is fitted onto a window, but of a window of this size, there'd be an argument for fitting another one on the other side. So this is the restrictor and the screws I'm going to use. These are self-drill screws. They have a drill bit tip for drilling through and screwing into metal. The restrictor catches onto the stud and is spring loaded to catch automatically when the window closes. Choose a position on the sash to fit the restrictor. The closer you fit to the hinge, the wider the restricted opening will be. Remember that the maximum restricted opening is 100mm. Notice that I'm positioning it to the back of the rebate. Next line the stud up on the frame. Notice I'm positioning it to the front of the rebate. Line it up until the restrictor strikes the stud and fix it with a screw. Test the restrictor strikes the stud and fix the last screw. Test that the restrictor is catching every time the window opens. Also release the restrictor and test that it catches automatically when it closes against the stud. And that's how you fit a restrictor on an aluminium window.